Hello Adesi and Pradesi foodies. Today's recipe is another jewel from the Mughlai cuisine, Sabz Nizami Handi. This is a dish wherein vegetables are cooked in a rich and creamy gravy, a delight to the taste buds and also very easy to make. So let's take a look at how we make this mouth-watering dish. So to start with, we are soaking 7 to 8 cashews and almonds in enough water for 20 minutes. After 20 minutes, grind them to a smooth paste. Next, we are going to boil the vegetables needed for the dish. So here we are taking one large potato cut into cubes, 5 to 6 cauliflower florets cut into small pieces, 1 carrot diced and 8 to 10 beans chopped. Add half a teaspoon of salt and boil till they are 50% cooked. Once the vegetables are 50% cooked, Drain the water and set them aside to be added to the curry later. Now let's start making the curry. So to a pan, add 2 tablespoons of ghee. When the ghee is hot, add half a teaspoon of shahi jeera, 3 cloves, 3 cardamom pods and 2 inch cinnamon stick. Allow the spices to infuse well in the oil and then add 1 medium sized sliced onion. We are adding half a teaspoon of salt to allow the onions to sweat and cook faster. When the onions turn translucent, add 1 teaspoon of ginger garlic paste and continue to cook till the raw smell of ginger garlic is gone. Now we are adding the puree of one large tomato. Mix well and continue to cook for 3 to 4 minutes on medium heat. Add half a teaspoon of turmeric powder, 3 4 teaspoon chili powder, half teaspoon coriander powder and one fourth teaspoon of cumin powder. Continue to cook for a minute or two till the spices are well incorporated together and the gravy starts releasing oil at the edges. At this stage, add two tablespoons of yogurt and mix thoroughly. Also add in the ground almond and cashew paste. Add 1 teaspoon of crushed kasuri methi and 1 fourth glass of water. Mix well, cover and cook for 2 to 3 minutes on medium heat. After 3 minutes of cooking, the gravy has cooked thoroughly. And now we are going to add in the semi boiled vegetables. Mix gently and then add half a glass of water to thin the consistency of the gravy. Cover and cook on medium heat for 5 minutes, stirring occasionally. At this stage, we are going to check for salt and adjust as per taste. And lastly, to add that extra creaminess to the dish, we are adding 2 tablespoons of double cream. Cover and cook for a further 1 minute. And dear friends, our mouth-watering, creamy and absolutely delicious Sabz Nizami Handi is ready. Every mouthful is a delight to the taste buds. We hope you enjoyed watching this video. Subscribe to our channel to stay tuned for more such mouth-watering recipes. And we will see you soon with another delicious recipe. Until then, stay safe and have a lovely week ahead.